Local high school students are living the spirit of the season and their high school motto, Men for Others. St. Louis 11's Jamie Travers has the story. Months of preparation and giving went into this year's food drive. These students at DeSmet Jesuit High School spent the afternoon unloading 36,000 pounds of food. I'm so proud of these guys. They've worked really, really hard to collect all this uh, food for others. And, and it's just the heart of who we are at DeSmet is forming men for others. And I think they're doing that today. St. Patrick's Center has about 2,800 households that they serve every year. And the work that these students do fills up their pantry for six months. It comes at a great time because over the summer, the pantry tends to go bare, and then coming in the fall, it fills up again and it uh, lasts through the winter, so it's awesome. Senior Jack Trout says this year's challenge brought the school together for a great cause. It feels good because it's, it's bonding us as a school, and the fact that we get to help out the community as well is just an added bonus. And it taught him how much work goes in behind the scenes. It gave him an appreciation for the people that run it and those that run St. Patrick's Center. I, uh, came down here one Saturday and served lunch to the people at around 11 mm -hmm. and um, I worked with a guy named Carl upstairs and he was great. He had a smile on his face the entire time and yeah. it's just it's an awesome thing to do and I encourage others to do it as well. Teacher Kennedy Phillips says planning began back in August and he's seen a lot of growth and maturity from these students as they work to reach their goal. I can't put it into words. It's been really um, makes what I do really worth it. Makes me feel really proud. And he's going to miss these seniors who put in a lot of hours. Staying after school working on videos, staying after school working on spreadsheets, planning things. Um, they've put in a lot. Um, so I'm just very, very grateful for them and I hope that they see what they're doing is making an impact on St. Louis um, and I hope that they see that you know we're very fortunate in a lot of ways and I think we have a purpose to give back to people that aren't as fortunate. Reported in St. Louis, Jamie Travers, St. Louis 11 News.